Yo, 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 what up, YouTube? Be is your boy Daddy Easy here. I pod your break hacker, otherwise known as only using me, Tomahawks. And today I got another unboxing for y'all. This one is the Ghost Recon Future Soldier uh, gamepad. This is for the Xbox 360, cost me 50 bucks, 49.99 with tax. This is for the Xbox 360. Now, this is a white control controller, as you can see right there. So, let's take this baby out of the package. So, get my box cutter. Break the seal right there and put the cutter away. Slide this baby out. More seals that I didn't see, so let's whip that shit out. That's what she said. Let's cut that shit right there. Okay. And let's open it up. So let's see what we get with this baby right here. So here's the extra cords, and here is the actual gamepad, if I can get it out. Okay, plastic, and here's the controller right there, there it is right there, and an extra piece right here if I can get this out of it. <clears throat> so here's the box, and here's the breakaway cord. Now the reason why they did that is for people that clumsy, clutches, and Let's say if you're playing a game and you accidentally run somewhere with the controller, if your kid is running around and you try to stop him real quick and you have that controller in your hand, you don't want to yank it out the system, you have the breakaway part that will stay inside and just breaks away. And it's also good for using it on your PC. So that's a good thing for having these cord controllers. Okay, so let's get down and dirty to it. So as you see right here, just take it, snap it on, and there you go right there, ready to be used. <clears throat> now this does have a nice texture to it actually it feels real good in the hands actually feels like a regular Xbox 360 controller now these parts right here it does glow when it's plugged in you have the regular star select and your um, main buttons your X Y B A buttons and all sticks your triggers stuff right here and in the back you do have the uh, combat buttons so it's more like a position which uh basically your right pad right pad left and right and stuff like that and for your audio so what I'm going to do is right now I'm going to place these down real quick and I'm going to place them into my PC just so you can see it light up now the cord the cord is extra long so where I'm at my computer is quite distance away from where I am so this will actually stretch all the way out to my PC so we just want to pop it inside the PC real quick as so and as you can see right there that this part did light up as you can see it is lit up and this is for the Ghost Recon Future Soldier stuff so I'm going to dim my lights real quick and as you can see the lights is dimmed close my shade up a little and as you can see it illuminates right here you can see the light is on so let's pull it up to the screen as you can see right there it is lit up so um I'm gonna do a gameplay real quick, do everything, and on my next video it's gonna be a gameplay of Modern Warfare 3, and I'm gonna let y'all know exactly how the controller feels with my new Triton AX 720s, 7.1 surround sound, um, Adobe's on it, I believe it's Adobe's so Adobe, Adobe, whatever. I'm not even sure the damn name. Uh, I'm rushing to do everything right now to get this video up on here for y'all. So stay tuned for my gameplay review, which is coming up, and this is the end of this video, and I'll catch my guys on that review. Peace.